Welcome to Statistronics. My name is Dr. Twane Jire. Now, in continuation of our series, we want to uh, look at the work example of what we did initially. So we are to use this. We have data for X and that of a Y. It could be anything. It could be weight gain and, and food intake. It could be rainfall and crop yield. It could be uh, data collected on anything. But let's just say the relationship between X and Y. So we are giving this data and then we want to use uh, the deviation method of correlation. Now, the deviation method, the formula is arrow. Arrow is equal to summation xy all over the square root of summation x square, summation y square. So if we have this, now we have to create a column for our small x and small y, noting that our Noting that our small x is equal to x minus x bar. And our small y is equal to y minus y bar. So if we have this, then we're going to create columns based on the formula. So the first is a small x. And for us to get our small x, it will be x minus x bar. So it means we have to calculate our x bar. So x bar will be summation of x. So what's the sum of x? If we sum x, what do we have? The summation of x is 40. So if we're adding this, it will be 40. Now, what's our summation of y? The sum of this is 50, which means that our x bar will be equal to summation of x all over n. And that's equal to what? 40 over our n is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 40 over 5, which is equal to 8. Now, our y bar will be equal to summation of y all over n. And our sum of y is equal to 50 all over our n is a 5. So this will be equal to 10. Now, the mean of, mean of x is 8. And then the mean of y is a 10. So our small x will be equal to 1 minus 8. So this is a 9 minus 8. 6 minus 8, 9 minus 8, and then 15 minus 8 will have a 7. Now, our small y, if you add this, is going to be 0. And that means that our mean was correct. Because we often say, as a property of the arithmetic mean, that the summation of the division is equal to 0. So our y, would, our small y, will be equal to, now the value of y here is 5. And then the mean of y is 10. So 5 minus 10, minus 5, 10 minus 10, 5 minus 10, 14 minus 10, 6, 16 minus 10. Also, if you sum this, it will also be equal to 0, which also satisfies the, the property of the arithmetic mean, that the, division, the sum of the division from the mean is equal to zero. So from the formula, we have x, y. So we'll create a column and call it x, uh, y. So x, y will be multiplying the values of x times y. So minus seven times minus five will be 35. One times zero will be zero. Two minus two times minus uh, five will be plus 10. And then one times four will be four. Seven times six will be 42. So if we sum this for our summation of y, it will be equal to, if we sum this, what do we have? Eh? 91. So the next thing we will have, um, the next thing we will be having is uh, from the formula, we have sum of x squared. So we'll create a column and call it x uh, squared. So this is our, our small x. So if we square this value, minus 7 squared, 1 square minus 2 square, 1 square, 7 square. Now, again, if we sum our x square, it will give us sum of x square is 1, 0, 4. Now, the next thing in the formula, again, we have a y square. So, we'll create a column and call it y square. Okay, so this is y minus 5. So, the square of minus 5. 
is 25. The square of 0, the square of minus 5, the square of 4, 16, the square of 6, 36. So the summation of our y square is equal to 102. Okay, now we've gotten the values from the table. So we are going to substitute all these values in the formula. So our arrow will be equal to sum of x, y is equal to 91 all over the square root of, now the sum of x square is 104 times the sum of y square, which is this, is 102. So this is going to give us um, 91 all over the square root of 104 times 102. 10608. So that will be equal to 91 over what's the square root of 10608? 102.99 what? 995. So this will be equal to um, our arrow value will be equal to 91 over 102.995. So this is 0 0.8. Eight three five, which is approximately eight eight uh, four. Hmm? Okay, so that's the value of arrow using the um, division uh, method. Please, if there's anything you don't understand, feel free to hit the comment uh, section. Make your comment, like the video, subscribe to our channel so that you'll be notified whenever we have a new uh, video. Thank you.